Sorry, people. I had promised I would not do another video until uh, after baby testimony has been found. But what I have just heard from Jeremiah could not allow me to hold my peace. See you in the video. You are welcome to the End Time Truth Television, the channel for the lovers of truth, for the truth of the end time. So if you are a lover of truth, give us a subscription and God bless you. Shalom. Some people say, ah, Jeremiah, some people did not hear me well. Jeremiah said before the ending of the month, uh, the baby will come out or blah, blah. I said, forget about those things. I said, good news will come. There is confusion in the camp of my enemies. And immediately the following day, the good news came. And everybody heard the story. Have you? Zoom people, if the baby come out or from anywhere, are you ready to celebrate with me? This baby that missing, you hear it good news. Amen. I said, before the ending of this month, a good news is coming. A good news is coming. Now what I told you people, what is the good news? The good news that I told you people, The good news is all about after the prophecy. And I said, there is confusion in the camp of our enemies. Mm. Mm. There is confusion now in the camp of our enemies. Before the break, I don't know what happened. Stories. Confusion. The good news started. That's how the good news started. Confusion. Immediately after the prophecy on Friday. Good news just came. There is no peace in the camp of our enemies. Everywhere is shaking. No peace. No peace. No peace. So that's how right now the good news that i've told you started the following day what a good news we are praying let there be confusion let there be quarrel let there be problem in the camp of our enemies and god go answer us is it not a good news yes papa is it not a good news yes papa commotion there is big problem in the camp of our enemies that was what I was telling you before. Even never reach even one day, never reach 24 hours after the prophecy. Who is a prophet? You are a prophet. Who is a prophet? You are a prophet, Papa. Confusion. Are you hearing me? Confusion. That what really happened immediately after the prophecy. There you go. And I told you people, some people say, ah, Jeremiah, some people did not hear me well. Jeremiah said before the ending of the month, and uh, the baby will come out, or blah blah. I said, forget about those things. I said, good news will come. There is confusion in the camp of my enemies. And immediately the following day, the good news came. And everybody hear the story, Abby? Yes, Papa. The confusion. I know you am. Remember last week? Last week, towards Friday, I told you people something on the Zoom, the hour of Zoom. I told you people something. That very day, I said, when the attack came, nobody, everywhere was silent. Everywhere was silent. And I cried to my Lord right on Zoom. And I told the people something. 
I said, before the ending of this month, a good news is coming. A good news is coming. Now what I told you people, what is the good news? The good news that I told you people, the good news is all about after the prophecy. And I said, there is confusion in the camp of our enemies. Mm. Mm. There is confusion now in the camp of our enemies. Before they break, I don't know what happened. Stories, confusion, the good news started. That's how the good news started. Confusion. Immediately after the prophecy on Friday, good news just came. There's no peace in the camp of our enemies. Wow. Everywhere shaking. No peace. No peace. No peace. So that's how right now the good news that I've told you started the following day. What a good news. We are praying, let there be confusion, let there be quarrel, let there be problem in the camp of our enemies. And God God answer us. Is it not a good news? Yes, Papa. Is it not a good news? Yes, Papa. Commotion. There is big problem in the camp of our enemies. That was what I was telling you before. Even never reach even one day, never reach 24 hours after the prophecy. And I told you people, some people say, ah, Jeremiah, some people did not hear me well. Jeremiah said, before the ending of the month, uh, the baby will come out, or blah, blah. I said, forget about those things. I said, good news will come. There is confusion in the camp of my enemies. And immediately the following day, the good news came. And everybody heard the story. Have you? Yes, Papa. The confusion. I know here I am. Oh, boasting. I am boasting. I am boasting. Go and ask. Go and ask. Before the ending of this month, the result was taken. out. Before the ending, the ending said too much. It will not end. Oh my God. If this thing will happen, if this is manifested, what will the world will say? And what the world will do? But you, that person now who are following me, are you ready to dance? And celebrate with me. Zoom people. If the baby come out all from anywhere, are you ready to celebrate with me? That accusation. I am telling you, listen, before the ending of this month. This story is a bygone story. Listen. Who is the prophet? Okay, if uh, I want to ask somebody now, if if this baby comes out, <laughs> what will you do? What will you do? Eh? I will rededicate myself to God. You rededicate? I will rededicate myself. What about you? If some people say, Ah, Jeremiah. Some people did not hear me well. Jeremiah said before the ending of the month, and uh, the baby will come out or blah blah. I said, forget about those things. I said. I am boasting. I am serving the living God. Boasting. I am boasting. I am boasting. Go and ask. Go and ask. Go and ask. Mark my word. Just mark my word. It will not take time. But I'm telling you what I'm telling you. Before the ending of this month, the result was taken out. Before the ending, the ending said too much. It will not end. If I be a prophet, you are a prophet. You are a prophet. If I be a prophet, you are a prophet. even not the mood, any second, any hour from now, you hear good news.
if I be a prophet, I told you, oh my God, if this thing will happen, if this is manifested, what will the world will say? And what the world will do? But you, that person now who are following me, are you ready to dance and celebrate with me? Yes. Who is the prophet? Okay, if I, I want to ask somebody now, if if this baby comes out, <laughs> what will you do? What will you do? Eh? I will rededicate myself to God. You rededicate. I will rededicate myself. What about you? If this baby now the enemy is the Lord said, he said the baby. He has set confusion among the people that who are who cause this calamity. Jesus. That is the God. That evil plan. He said he want to now bring up. He will to put them to shame. What will you do? What will you that watching me? What will you do? What what will you do to God? But I will tell you. A feast of Thanksgiving. Hey, listen. Take this my word. Even one second. So this put a random. This baby that missing, you hear a good news. Amen. Even one second to this mood. I am not, I have what I have seen in the realm of the spirit. I'm seeing. How can you accuse the person like this? If I carry the grace of Moses, if I carry the grace of Elisha and Elijah, if I carry the grace of El Dikel, if I carry the grace of Joshua, if I carry the grace of Jeremiah, from now to the end of this month, before the ending, <laughs> hey, people ask, okay, he's a man of God. They are asked, they are attacking yes. now. What is going on now? Yes. Prayer from a man of God. If prayer can change the story of Israel, hello people good morning good afternoon good evening god bless you today i hope this video meets you well i once again want to say that i appreciate all of you my wonderful viewers our returning viewers and subscribers and you who also are coming for the very first time or you may have been visiting and going but you've not subscribed i want to say i appreciate each and every one of you i don't take you for granted may i assure you that i understand that without you out there there wouldn't be me here God bless you and I want to plead that you subscribe if you have not subscribed to the channel before activate the bell icon by selecting all so that whenever I upload a new video you will be among those that will get the notification first from Google I don't also want to forget to ask you to please share this video help so that we can grow together God bless you yeah, there is something that is amazing that I have. You know, people have been saying something about the prophecy of Jeremiah. And there was even somebody who is so sure and certain that Jeremiah is a prophet, is a man of God, that he prophesied that there was going to be a confusion in the midst amongst the, in the enemy's camp. And uh, suddenly there was some form of uh, disagreement between the bloggers who have been trying to cover the Ruth Matthew issue. And so there has been celebration in the camp. And somebody was like, have I seen that, that Jeremiah was a man of God? He had made a prophecy and before too long, the prophecy came to pass. That I should wait again to see how the prophecy of the missing baby who Jeremiah promised all of us that before the end of this month, the baby was going to be found. Today is the last month of March 2022, March 31st. And to be sincere with you, I have seen something that made me believe that this man indeed, you know, I've never believed in him, but this time around, I want to tell you my belief in Jeremiah being a Satanist has actually been reinforced. I've never accused him of anything, neither will I accuse him of something I'm not sure. Uh, but just like you have always heard me say, I only speak based on what I found them do. I find them do or say. Their actions and the inactions, even their silence speaks a lot. All right, so in this sense now, we're looking at a blatant liar, a manipulator. We're looking at somebody who 
who has no respect for posterity, somebody who has no conscience, somebody whose conscience seems to have been blotted out and he is just operating, you know, in the guise of, of being a prophet, a pastor, a leader of the people, though he calls himself more of a prophet than he's not a pastor. Please, before I speak too much, because I'm seething with a lot of, a lot of, uh, you know, displeasure that I'm trying to put under control. But I was watching these things. I was like, is this happening here on earth? Or am I dreaming? But actually, I'm not dreaming. It is real. Men and brethren, may I shock you with this, the recent development coming from the two mouths of the so-called prophet. And I think that he is a prophet of Baal. God bless you. Okay, um, thank you. You have seen what I saw. And I, I'm not sure if you are not feeling worse than I'm feeling now. My question and the problem I have is the people. Those people. I did a video here where I was saying that majority of us are helping the markets of these liars to sell. And somebody sent a comment that I was speaking from the two sides of my mouth. Why would I be making excuses for fake pastors that um, they are responsible for what they are doing? I've never said they are not responsible of, of, for their actions. They know what they are doing. But if there was no aiders and abettors in the crowd, they would have stopped doing what they are doing. Now, why am I saying this? Jeremiah spoke in his studio while addressing the Zoom congregation, which, you know, embodies both those that are around him in worry there and those listening to him from around the world. He, he spoke for a very long time and he made elaborate statements promising the people that on or before the end of this month, baby testimony was going to be found. In fact, he turned to them and said, are you ready to dance with me? You heard it in that video. Now, if these people are not under a spell, why will it be the same people that will turn? Jeremiah just told them, I didn't say so. And you heard all of them echoing, hey, clapping, and I don't get it. I really don't get it. Is it really true that these people left their brains outside of the Mercy City gate and they came in without being human? In fact, it's like there is something at the gate that wants you cross the gate. That thing takes over your brain. You don't reason again. You don't think again. Now, if the entire crowd has, seems to have forgotten, they don't remember again, or they just want to follow the bandwagon, I want to ask those two, a man and a lady that was with Jeremiah in that studio, that he gave microphone to, to tell him what they will do. One said he was going to rededicate his life to God afresh, the male. And the other one said what he was going to do, uh, organize a service of proper thanksgiving to God if the baby was found. And here we are now discussing Jeremiah, refuting and denying that he never promised that the baby was going to come out. Now, I'd like you, I'd like you to decide for yourself, who do you think Jeremiah is? Who do you think Jeremiah is? And what do you think of this, the most gullible congregation I've ever seen in my life? The most, God forgive me, but I think that I've not seen a people so stupid. I've not seen a generation so 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 irresponsible like I'm just witnessing in this video. I've I've always minded my language. I've always hated using strong wordings. But these people are not deserving of anything that is dignifying. They are the most undignified people that I've ever seen under the sun. How is it possible that adults, not children, just merely about four days or five days ago that this thing was said. Even though that we have, you know, I, I, been, been a, um, um, apprehensive, I've not completely believed that Jeremiah, you know, meant it because I never thought he was a prophet. I never, I never, I never see him as a prophet. He could be a prophet of something else. He could be a prophet of some deities. He could be a prophet of Baal. But I know that he is not of God. Jesus tells us that when you speak, you speak the language of your father. For your father is a liar and he is the father of all liars. So when I say Jer Jeremiah is a Satanist, 
I mean, what I'm saying, he is never of God. He's a... See, I, I have heard that there is, there is this thing that they do, some of these occultists. This thing that they do that people must react to whatever they, you know, they say, do whatever they say. And, you know, they, they, they have this, this power of hypnotizing their congregation. And I think that is what it has, is, is at work here. I want to stop here because I am so disappointed. I am so disappointed. I am so disappointed. What is this, people? What is this? Who does this? if not only Jeremiah and his kinds. Let me read your comment in the comment section and let me know what you think of this barbaric uh, human being. I have not seen this type before. God bless you. I'll be seeing you in the next video shortly. I remember your brother in the Lord. I remember your brother in the Lord. Ah, I know a lot of, uh, you know, a lot of people will want to Come after me for saying this. No, it's not even necessary. I remember your brother in the Lord and I. I will see you in the next video. Shalom.